I've always been fascinated by the natural world, animals, plants, just wildlife in general since I was a little kid. I was driving by the zoo one day and the proverbial light bulb came on, I guess. Man, I should try to get a job at a zoo, you know? I, I'd never thought about it before. I've always been into bird watching, looking for snakes when I was a kid. And everyone knew me as, you know, the, the animal guy, you know? And I just realized that this would be a great, a great profession for me. You know, I thought that starting here, working at the zoo, was going to be all about the animals, and certainly that's a huge part of what it is, but it's really all about the communication with the people who come here to the zoo. I've always wanted to work with kids, and this is an opportunity for me to work with kids from all over the place, from all different walks of life. So many kids come here on field trips that that's their one time a year to come to the zoo. My favorite part of the zoo is like all the parts because I love looking at all the birds and all the animals. I'm just able to work with them here and share my love of animals, but also introduce them to new animals that they may not know, animals that might not be very common. There's nothing quite like it. The look of wonder that comes across a child's face when they see a wild animal for the first time. It's not a cartoon. There's something really profound about the look that goes over their face and the, the silent wonder of it all. I think zoos are very important. I think the average person can't go visit snow leopards in the Himalayas or go to Africa to see lions. And so I think by having animals here, we can educate the public. They can see things that they might not be aware of. A lot of zoos for a long time were viewed as a place to be entertained. Come to the zoo, you see some animals, great, had a good time, go home. But I want to do more than that. I want to convey to people how important it is to save these animals that are all, all around us, because if we don't intervene, they're going to be extinct. I think the zoo has helped me understand that there are small things that we can do every day as individuals that will help conserve our neighborhood habitats and the habitats around the world for wildlife. You really can take very small steps and you can make a huge difference in the world, like buying shade-grown coffee or not watering your lawn when it doesn't need it. All of those things make a huge difference. I want to make sure that being part of the zoo, uh, I feel like I have a purpose. I feel like I'm helping people to realize local conservation and local conservation is vitally important to our future. My name is Adam. My name is Melissa. My name is Sarah. My name is Nick. Norma Cole. Anna Martin. My name is Prim. And I'm an education programs coordinator. I'm a zoo volunteer. I'm a docent. I'm a camp instructor. I'm an animal unit volunteer. And I am a zoo visitor. I'm a zookeeper at the tropical rainforest at the Woodland Park Zoo.